Hey, my name is Sass. Welcome to today's video. Today we're doing some assignments that were assigned by our teachers and we're going to start off with the Quidditch pitch, which I need to fly instead. So there's five balloons over the Quidditch pitch, which we need to pop. Just need to see them all. One, two, three. Whoa. Oh, okay. Let's not fall down. <laughs> fall down there. Okay, let's get on a broom. How do we pop them? Do we go through it? Well, I'm missing that. Okay, pop balloons around Quidditch pitch. We're gonna aim Whoa, can we even... I don't even know how to aim. Let's go up. And we'll aim for that one. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. <laughs> okay, we're not good at this. Okay, I'm going straight for this one. No, that's not how I do it. There's got to be a way to pop these balloons. Can't cast any spells. So how do you pop them? Oh! Okay, they're much easier than I thought. So you got to pop them down. There we go. Okay. Okay, we popped them. That was easy. I was aiming for the wrong part of the balloon. <laughs> Ooh, oh, yay! Okay, I see the other one. Oh, nice! Where's the other one? Yay! Oh, well, I must have hit it wrong because I was touching it already at the top. So now we got to find some balloons over Hogsmeade Station. Are they the ones at Hogsmeade Station? That... That's not... <laughs> They're not the right balloons. They're not the right balloons. I see the balloons. We'll go for this one first. Ah! Oh, I got it. Oh, <laughs> I just completely dodged that. Let's turn around. Okay, so there's that one over there. Brilliant. Yay! Return to Madame Kagawa. Where are you, Madame Kagawa? How did you get on with those oh. tasks? Madame Kagawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Yes. Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Pay attention to your wand work. Whoa, okay. Go down, up. Down. Whoa, I did really bad. Yes! Glacius! Now we're going to do Professor Sharp's assignment. Acquire and use Focus Potion. Acquire Maxima and Endurance Potions and use them simultaneously. I feel like I have both, or three of them. So I have 
Endurous Potion. Maxima Potion. Oh, I don't have a... Focus Potion. Alright, we're gonna go buy a Focus Potion. Where are you, Jay Pippins? Oh. <laughs> Jay Pippins is right there. Hello, we have Jay everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Yeah, I have a good look around. Focus potion. What can I do for you today? What's that? Recipe. I don't want a recipe. I want a focus potion. A wise decision. <laughs> I heard something. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was it. Delicious. <laughs> okay, so I need to use two more potions. Okay, we need to hide a little bit. Let's open the potions. We need... 20 seconds duration of that, and then that one's got 20 seconds. So we're gonna. Oh, where is the enemy? Okay, right there. Gonna have to drink that. Gonna, that one, gonna drink that. Excellent! Where is he? Oh. Ah, oh, we did it! We did it! Whoa. Someone's going to regret Nothing more than luck. Confringo! No, too hard. Huh? Whoa, there's like a whole field of them. Avoiding our Nice. Give me some money. 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 Oh, jeez. Okay, let's attend potions class. Professor Sharp is so intimidating. Professor How are Sharp. your assignments coming along? I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. Is to pulso. You've got it now. Rebellion. If you'd like to practice, to pulso repels many types of objects and enemies with considerable force. Ooh! Although it deals with no direct damage to foes, enemies and objects alike can be launched into each other with destructive results. Also useful for pushing and spinning objects for a variety of purposes. Okay, so we've got Madame Kagawa's assignment. Practice flying near the spires. Practice flying near Keenbridge Tower. So, Keenbridge Tower along the water to the south of Hogwarts. Okay, so I sort of have to aim for these. Bubbles. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, we got this last bubble. Do I have to pop the balloons?
gonna pop them. Okay, I must have to pop the balloons. I completely ignored the balloons. Didn't say pop the balloons. Oh, you. <laughs> okay, so we're missing the balloons completely. <laughs> we'll do it again, we'll do it again. Just need to get the three balloons. Come on, you can do this. <laughs> that sucked. It's right there, there we go. That's so difficult. There we go. Okay, now we're going to go to this tower. did better than last time. Oh, <laughs> makes me go too fast. Whee! Okay, we're gonna get you. That's it! Yay! Reporting back, Professor. Assignment's all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say, and you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice a restore momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Precise, deliberate movements. Yay! A resto momentum. A resto momentum. What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent. Outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class, Summoner's Court isn't just a game. It's a battle of skill. A test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. Okay, so we're just Summoner's gonna court. The ever challenge game. this random guy. Akio. What? I don't even know. Nothing to it. Akio. What? Oh! Oh no! <laughs> Missed the mark a bit on that one. Up here. All in the wrist. Well, he's winning. And I am losing. Oh, I just made him gain a point. That was one for the ages. Uh oh. Oh. Try to beat that. Uh, I can't. Unless I knock both his out. Yes! No! Yes! How do you do that? Well done. You beat me. I did! 
<laughs> oh man, that was lucky. That was very lucky. Bit of good luck, that's all. Come now, Leander, there's no need for that. Fine, you're good. Better than I am, at least. I'll let the others know you're good enough to keep playing. The others? I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. The others who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be enough of a challenge. Chin up, Leander. Keep practicing and you'll get better. I suppose you're right. I'll let the others know that your metal's been tested and that you passed. Cool. Thanks. Yay! Okay, so we've done a few things today. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We did a lot of chores, basically, just learning a few things. I uh, will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching.